of course, Oliver's gonna start pressing buttons on his police truck. Um, it's been about four months since I have vlogged anything at all, and I have a really good excuse. <laughs> um, Oliver and I have a new man in our lives. I, he's not even new anymore. I mean, he's been here for a while now, and uh, you know, I never thought that. No, I can't say never. I didn't really think that at least anytime soon I would be finding somebody that wanted to not only be with me, but be with Oliver and tackle the whole special needs kid thing. I thought it was going to be hard enough to be a single parent, a single mom, to try to find a guy who wanted to take on the role of like a stepdad type of situation. Um, I thought it was basically damn near impossible to find somebody that wanted to take on a kid with Down syndrome on top of that, especially a toddler. Um, but somehow we found him. He's he's phenomenal. You're going to see it in this, in this vlog. Uh, finally things are getting settled down and uh, he's moving up here. He lives about two hours away and we are in the process of moving him right now. I am painting and we were putting in new flooring this weekend and there's somebody here with a messy face. Ugh. There he is. Say hi to the camera. Say hey. I haven't been on camera in a long time. We are at 28 months old now and we weigh about the equivalent of no, we don't even weigh that much. I don't know why you're saying we. Uh, we've almost hit 25 pounds. Uh, yeah, 25 pounds that, 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 that. as a over two year old. And we're still looking at about 30 inches in height. So not much has changed on the Oliver front. Um, literally this, this winter has been great. He only got sick two or three times. No, okay, well, I'll let you down. No hospital stays at all. And uh, yeah, Tubes really did a great job. And we actually. <laughs> we have surgery coming up on June 15th for removal of tonsils, adenoids, new ear tubes, and a possible eye surgery to correct his cross eye. We have not seen the specialist yet, but we will really soon. So other than that, he's doing amazingly. He's conquering his milestones. He hasn't been sick. I mean, he's just doing great. So there wasn't too much to talk about these last couple of months. Basically, it's just being in that awesome new phase of a relationship where we get to learn about each other and figure each other out. And now we got really comfortable really fast. You know, it's uh it's just like when you know, you know, and I'm so thankful for him, and I'm so happy that Oliver has an amazing influence in his life. I mean, just fully embracing this lifestyle that, you know, we've established. He's coming into our routine and just embracing it so fully. And I'm just really excited about life, and I'm excited about all these changes, and I'm excited that Oliver's like thriving. And, you know, he's still small, he's still short, he's still behind, but that's what it is, you know. He's starting to take a few steps here and there. And, you know, a lot of people are really concerned about the fact that he's not just fully walking it and we need to really be pushing it. And, yeah, he's in PT and we're practicing and every day I pick him up and we walk. But dude is stubborn. It was the same with crawling. When he decides that walking is a more efficient way of getting around than crawling, he will do it. You know, I've really come to the, you know, I've just like, I've come come to terms with it, that he will always be behind. We will do everything we can to make sure that he is as le less behind as possible, but he's always going to be slower. He's always going to get things done at his own pace. And you know, I'm just here enjoying the ride. So I hope you like this vlog. Definitely going to keep going. And, uh, coming up with some new topics for intros and stuff. But uh, I love you guys. I love how much you love watching Oliver and experiencing his life with me. He's the coolest kid in the world. And now I get to share all of this amazingness with Brian as well. And yeah, life is good. So see you guys in the next one. Ollie, are we going to the aquarium? Am I finally vlogging again for the first time in forever? It's this guy's fault. No, not vlogging because I spend all my time with you. But now that our relationship is boring and old, <laughs> wow. we're gonna go to the aquarium. Why are you walking? <laughs> <It looks so weird. laughs> yeah.
Everything's up for grabs in the vlog. Look at that beautiful man, though. Look at that beautiful man. They got the two most handsome men's in the world. Look at these fishes, and you are way more interested in all the people. You say hi to the fishies? Look at that booger. It's the first thing Oliver's actually interested in is a stingray. Pretty cool, huh? I like him. Want to go take him? Want to take him home? Want a stingray pet? I'd take care of him. See that one up there? You're gonna see. You're gonna see that one again. There's like a tank over here. It's way bigger. This fish nerd. Fish nerd. I like fish. It's a shark. Look out. Look at his face. Look at this eel, dude. He's coming back, Ollie. Is this so fun? Mwah. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Is a dolphin coming at ya? <laughs> Do you like the dolphins? Are you having? Like, sounds like beluga farts over here. I think that's not beluga farts. I think that's your fart. I think it is. Oh. <laughs> Oliver. Oliver. You having fun so far? Yeah. Did you just wave at a beluga whale? Did you say hi, beluga whale? Fishy still? Yeah. Taught me a lot about fish today. And with that, the day is over. 